All right, what's going on, everybody? Let me talk to you, YouTube. My name is Captain Crush, and what I do is I discuss fantasy sports, prize picks, fantasy, underdog, sleeper, thrive, fantasy. All of it will be discussed and talked about in the future. For now, I have four WNBA games that I want to go over, and I hope to find some value in this dumpster we call WNBA season long. But maybe, just maybe, we can be on the right side tonight and find some green beans and pick out all those red peppers peppers that nobody likes. Nobody likes red peppers with a side of chalk. We want 10x, 3x, 5x, all the x's baby. That's the goal here and that is what I am going to attempt to achieve. We have four games to discuss today and I got the Sparks facing off the dream. Four and a half point spread over under 166.5. The Mystics and the Dallas Wings over under 161 and a half. Minus six and a half spread for the Wings. Chicago Sky and Indiana Fever. Lord knows it's gonna be a stinker. Over under 150 59 and a half and a two and a half point spread and last but certainly not least a blowout brewing in seattle new york liberty versus seattle 10 and a half point dog brianna stewart returns home to face off against her former team 170 and a half point total this is the highest total on the slate so hopefully we can find some goodies down there all right this sleek little bet here that has game props trends whatever else you want is outlier bet if you're interested in it app.outlier.bet promo code crush get you 37 free days otherwise i don't know what you're doing now we go straight to the king of the road prize picks listen i got beef to pick with prize picks yesterday i'm doing god's work i'm in walmart shopping for my woman's list going leg by leg of that list checking them off cashing green beans i put out a list for the discord a, a, a contest if you will a pick five and i forgot to cancel it triggered my five flex free entry for 5k i didn't want to do that unfortunately it chalked big time. I woke up this morning to put in a five flex. I realized, why isn't it triggering my free entry? And then it hit me. Bang. I forgot to cancel it. What? Bang. I forgot to cancel it. $500. The contest. The freebie. I've been saving it for the John Deere Classic next week. It's flushed down the toilet. I didn't even have a legit shot. The worst thing about it all is the fact that three days ago, I put in a five green bean special, all cash, and I canceled it then. I didn't forget to cancel then, and it cashed. So I cost myself a crispy 5k in promo fund. So I'm coming back with a vengeance and I will take that 5k. I demand it. I call it. I speak it into existence. It's coming to my prize picks account. The only difference is I'm going to have to put up the five large to get it. And it won't be promo funds when it hits my account. It's going to be straight cash. But let's get started. I had to give you my little rant so you could know how my morning went. Hopefully you guys had a better morning. I had a great night last night. I will say that. But the morning was kind of of mid you never want to wake up in the morning and find out your free entry's been chalked that you didn't even mean to you so right out of the gate there's a woman I want to talk about. Satao Savali, nine and a half rebounds. Vegas likes under. My model has her at 10. Me, the captain, I looked at her head to head. She's literally gotten this matchup before she torched it. Washington's given up, I believe, 10th. They're almost dead last in rebounds allowed. Let me go check that on Outlier Bet since I got a little bit of time. Oh yeah, buddy. Just like I said, they're 10th right here. Bang, green. They're 10th in rebounds allowed. The last time she played, it was June 2nd, a cold day in June. Yeah, it's cold in June. Imagine Imagine that it don't make no sense she had 14 rebounds now her last five it's ugly three red peppers two green beans what are we gonna do we're taking more and if you sell sabali you sell i'm well prepared for it trust me kids in the beginning of the day i was on less but now i'm on more and if i do say so myself just like last night with collier the day before with howard and asia i've been crushing these rebound props so by god let the trend continue because sold captain's here to feed him on that same coin natasha howard seven and a half rebounds whoa whoa, whoa. all right nika aguamike 10 rebounds i liked her at nine and a half they bumped it up to 10 if you want to take a shot on her rebounds you can i like another prop for her, which we will talk about later alicia gray she was at four and a half now she's at five if you want to take uh more on five and 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 hopefully you get hopefully you get a push because i think she's gonna get exactly five you can all right miss boston was at eight and a half now she's at nine they're bumping everything around here prize picks you you didn't even give me a chance to get my youtube out before you bumped it folks this is why i tell y'all if you're ready to take 
take the next step, hop in to the captain's discord because all that stuff gets posted early before these friggin' bumps. These bumps are insane, okay? Brianna Stewart, nine and a half rebounds. She's been putting up stinker after stinker. Check this out. Five rebounds, nine rebounds against Connecticut. She hooked me. She played June 25th, Washington Mystic. The I showed you already their 10th of rebounds allowed. She only got six, then Atlanta 11, then in Phoenix, she got 14. Now she's going back to her old team. Can she get 10 rebounds? My money is on more. I hope she gets it done. If she doesn't, I won't cry. I won't complain. I'll move on. That'll be that. However, Ezzy Magabor, eight and a half rebounds. I'm liking less. That's right, folks, less. And I love Ezzy. Everybody in the chat knows that I love Ezzy Magabor. Mag beggar, if you will. But tonight is not her night. At least in my opinion, I will take less. If you don't agree with that, just fade the prop. Taking her to get nine rebounds in that matchup is kind of ridiculous. But John Quell Jones, she sold my pick four free entry last week. I got three of four. $150 in promo funds. Guess what? I'll take that all day, twice on Sunday. But I wanted the full 500. But she sold by half a fantasy point because she got a turnover. But on top of that, it was a blowout. But now, seven rebounds. I like more. I'm taking my chances. Again, look at these last five. Not that I care about the last five, which is why I'm going to try to not show you the last five as much. Six, 11, 10, 9, 11. The range of outcomes is going to be between five and nine tonight. That's my humble opinion. My model concurs. I'm taking more. I'm also going right back to her fantasy score because maybe I'm a little bit crazy and I haven't learned. I don't care if it's the right play. Give it to me. And guess what? It's Sunday. So twice on Sunday, I'll take it. I'll have her spread around in two different contests. I'm ready to roll. America's sweet heart right here alana smith six and a half rebounds normally she's at seven i always tell you guys to take less at seven but now she's facing indiana she's at six and a half if finally you get the captain's approval to take more at six and a half if you want to take more at six and a half i ain't gonna punish you for it i won't make fun of you go ahead and take more at six and a half i will not get upset you have my blessing and believe me when i tell you the captain's blessing is worth its weight in gold and my oh my did i think these games were at three central today and they're at two central so i gotta get flying which means the editing's gonna be trash my fancy overlays are gonna be limited and the captain's gonna be flying like like a freight train on steroids i guess you could say let's keep this train moving uh alicia gray 17 and a half points i don't hate taking more there but i got news for you i'm taking her fantasy points we'll get there nika aguamike more than 19 and a half points it's time nika i've been cashing your under train you got 14 16 27 20 20 and 20 it's time for you to get 21 real points the captain's needing you i need you to help me feed my flock okay i got more on nika aguamike and i'm ready to get burned marie uh marina mabry 15 points let's talk about marina mabry for one second at 15 and a half give me under but at 15 oh boy that half a put a half a point that hook it means everything to me give me more on marina mabry and guess what i'm ready to eat chalk on that give me the red peppers i'll eat them all because at 15 points she torched team last time they played not that that means too much you value the life no i don't my point is is that look at the last five here and what do you see you see red pep she's been stink stank and has stunk and now she's going into a good matchup and i think it just might be bounce back so as i say less at 15 and a half more at 15 and give me some positive variance come on girl it's time to make that bucket daddy needs new shoes and on that same coin you could take Khalid copper more than 16 and a half points too i absolutely like it but check this out do not under any circumstances put both of these in the same contest it's bad form it's bad etiquette it's bad all around pick one one or the other or fade them both okay not that they're not good props i just don't like them in the same contest because likeliness of them both getting over is harder than just one of them so why have them both in the same contest and give yourself some i have to coin the, i have to coin it out but I, I don't have a word for it yet but just trust me on this separate them if you're gonna take them we're trying to build slips that correlate okay trying to do god's work here and teach you guys correct process Aliyah boston she was at six now she's at 16 and a half what do we do look left look right we fade 
I like her at 16, but at 16 and a half, it's fade season for me, fam. Okay. Jewel Lloyd. Hey, hey, uh, my boy in the Discord, Quan Locks. Last game, she had zero points after the first quarter. I was on her over real points. I told my Discord to take over on the real points. Guess what? Quan said she's soaring under after one quarter. And let the fact stand that she soared over. I believe it was 40. Oh yeah, 41 points. You never want to be claiming a victory after one quarter in any sport, folks. Trust me. It's a volatile game you never celebrate you never cry until the final whistle and that's with anything you bet and that's also a life lesson okay apply it to your life and then go from there and then give me the thank you but the move tonight with jewel lloyd most likely with this 10 and a half point spread it's either she's gonna come out and go on fire or she's gonna come out and chalk i'm taking less because i'm going back the last time i was on more now i'm going less it's 24 and a half give me less and if she sells oh well I'm I already cashed on her last game, but now I'm going right back to less. Spread is too high. She can come out and torch you. She's one girl on that team that come out, bang, cash it, bang, cash it. Just three pointers at will, just splashing and splishing and splooshing around in the hoop. And then we're eating red peppers tonight. It's what's for dinner. But I am taking less, and I advise you to do the same. Again, it's just an ed it's just advice. You don't have to take it, folks. Go with your gut at the end of the day. I'm just one man rambling here about what I like. That's pretty much it for the real points section that I want to. Oh, I almost forgot about Ariel Atkins. My favorite, Ella Della Don. It rolls off your tongue. She's out tonight. Washington's going to need more people to score. What do we got? What do we see? Ariel Atkins, she sold last time for me. 10 points, but guess what? I'm going right back to that well. More, 14 and a half points. Hopefully, she, she's forced to score more because Ella Della's out there. Someone's got to score points. Cloud's not really a shooter. She's more of a facilitator. So I will take my chances with Atkins. I will take her points. I'll go back to her fantasy court. And with that, I got one more. Arike Angumbawale. 20 and a half points if you want to take a shot here and go more here you can but i like something different which is going to make me segue right into fantasy scores oh yeah buddy arike more than 30 and a half fantasy points i ever going for 33 in my model but guess what my model could easily be wrong i could be wrong you could be wrong we won't know until that final whistle but look at this 40 38 30 26 53 what do you see what do you got she's got a floor of 25 and she's got a ceiling of six bet bet and bet so at 30 and a half right in the middle of the road give me over give me nothing i would not take less on this take more or fade it so Bali, you want to take a shot and take her fantasy points you want to stay away from her rebounds you absolutely could take more here but i will say this this is the most tough matchup in their little league washington plays the toughest defense they're missing a few key players so maybe that affects it a little bit i'm not sure because there's no tool that lets me put wmba players on and off the court so if any of you web developer geniuses are listening to that make some tools because the, I'll plug it for you and you better I mean what are we doing here this is amateur hour here if you want the WNBA to succeed let's get some analytical tools all right I just talked about Ariel Atkins 26 and a half fantasy points you can put it in there like I said I like her points more she's more likely to clear the points line than the fantasy line but both are valid Alicia Gray that's right Alicia Gray 29 and a half fantasy points I got her going for 32 she just played in the toughest matchup and put up a 44 burger then she played she played him again nah not so good we won't even look at that 29 for the liberty dallas whoo what a stinker that was girl and indiana put up 35 now the sparks they play pretty decent defense believe it or not they play at a fast pace but they play de decent defense i think alicia gray is gonna get it done tonight i hope she gets it done because i got a lot riding on her and with that miss parker you're getting the more treatment too i was just taking less at 33 and a half fantasy points 34 fantasy points now they deflate you down four points give me more at 29 girl you got some killer eyes eyelashes i know it my chat knows it everybody knows it so go out there bat your eyelashes get some points and take me more and give me a green bean i'm begging so i talked about kalia copper i talked about mabry i like their other propositions i'm not really a fan of the fantasy score Aliyah boston was at 35 fantasy points they bumped it up that little half a half of a point it is what it is i still like it miss boston she's got that amazing hair she's a monster in the paint and she's crushing and she will crush hopefully tonight Night. she bounced back she had a bit of a stinker in phoenix hey it happens everybody's human even i have a bad game every now and again it's never about one night it's never about one week it's never even about one month it's about consistency month after month day after day week after week okay i don't make decisions based off of one event you shouldn't either okay everybody gets it wrong everybody gets it right now and again the point is is are you learning brianna stewart 44 and a half fantasy points my oh my she was at 43 when i woke up this morning now she's at 40 four and a half if you want to take first half i don't even
even know what the line is because I ain't taking first halves today. I'm sweating full game. It's Sunday. I ain't got nowhere to be. Woman's gone. She's at an air show. I'm home alone. It's just me and the dogs. What can we say? We're going to be watching WNBA. We were watching some golf. I paused everything to do some YouTube for the YouTube faithful. So I will sweat these games. Brianna Stewart, 44 and a half fantasy. Look at the red pepper, red pepper, red pepper, red pepper, green bean. Oh yeah, it's been a minute since she's had a green bean. Listen, she was in this matchup already this season. I think she disappointed me. Fact, I know she disappointed me. I ain't going to take the time to go back. But 24 fantasy points last game, 41, 31, 40. What's going on with you, Stewie? You ain't the Luca of freaking WNBA if you, if you can't be getting 40 fantasy points in a game. All right? I don't know what I'm doing with her yet. I like her rebounds. More on nine and a half rebounds. But her fantasy score, I don't know what I'm doing there. I really don't. I just wanted to cover it because she's Stewie. And we got to talk about Stewie, okay? I talked about Lloyd. I talked about Magabor. Uh, Alana Smith talked about her rebounds. But guess what? If you want to take more on her fantasy score, you can take a seat right next to me and give me a high five because I got more 28 and a half fantasy points in my main slip. That's right. If she sells, by God, I'm going broke tonight. And then John Quell Jones, the one person who had that garbage turnover to sell my pick four free entry for the 500 and promo girl. Chance to make it right tonight. You can make all the wrongs right in the world. You can cash my main slip. Give me back what you cost me. And I will sing of your praises on my next YouTube video. You cash that, John Quell. I will have your back like a shirt. Give me more on Miss Jones. I will keep up with the Joneses tonight if she cashes. And I'm going to cover one last person. Two more people. Natasha Cloud, 30 fantasy points. Listen, there's no Ella Della. If you want to take a shot on Miss Cloud and take her fantasy points more, you absolutely could. But I'm telling you, you better hope that game stays close so the run back would be Arike or Sabali with that matchup or Howard I like Howard at 31 and a half fantasy points if you want to take Howard you absolutely can I'm going to do one last thing for you folks this is what a, uh this would be my favorite from each on the fantasy side because some people believe it or not can only put in fantasy points so we would have Howard over there we'd have Howard or Arike but I'm siding with Howard Gray over here Parker either one of those is fine let's just let's just keep it with Parker Alana Smith Jean Quell Jones and Aaliyah Boston. Those would be my favorites, I guess, if you wanted from each different team, I guess. That, that would be my favorite there with everything else I spoke about. If you tail that directly and it chalks, all oh, it goes 0 for 5, all red peppers. I don't care, okay? I'm just giving you my advice. My job isn't to give you picks on YouTube. If you think that, take a walk. I'm not here to give you picks. I'm here to get you to think about what you should be doing. Would you rather me just give you a fish or teach you how to fish? And I know that's a stupid cliche because everybody in the human world just like well just give me the fish i'm hungry bro but point remain that's not what this is about prize picks you're playing against the house you ain't playing against me but for now i'm just trying to get you better at playing against the house and prize pick oh my they're the house we want to win together that is what i want i want you guys to get thinking the way you should a lot of you guys are young and no one's ever taught you consider captain crush your mentor okay that's why i'm here to mentor you young heads into thinking the right way when it comes to analytics because nobody's taught you i don't care what you think you know you don't but my oh my for my alabama faithful for the lawmakers that absolutely made my life difficult this is what i got if you want to take kalia copper and marina mabry more than three three points made i don't hate it i will have some shares of this absolutely okay and then as far as assist combination if you want to go ahead and take brianna stewart and courtney vandersloot more than 12 and a half assists i don't hate that one either and then as far as points combo this is ridiculous i cannot believe Alabama such a great state and this is what they do I've been to Tuscaloosa I've been at an Alabama game roll tide and boy oh boy it was one of the funnest life experiences I've had I was like 20 years old and I will never forget it but my god did they drop the ball with this Ryan Howard Rin Howard however you want to say it with Alicia Gray more 34 points that ain't bad so there's there's three there that I like. Again, just apply everything that I said in the video. Apply it to these combos for you Alabama folks. Listen, those are very hard to do. Hopefully something comes down the pike where I can get better at it and y'all can get blessed. Now, for my underdog faithful, did you think I forgot about you? I didn't. Courtney Williams, lower than five and a half assists. Dierica Hamby, higher than 20 and a half points, rebounds, and assists. Or her regular points, whichever. Alicia Gray, higher than four and a half rebounds. Alana Smith, higher than six and a half rebounds. 
rebounds. And last but certainly not least, look at that hair. I love it. Aaliyah Boston, higher than 16 points, okay? I put five on this to win 100 for YouTube purposes. I always recommend you guys ensure your contest. Whatever it is that you're doing, ensure it. If you want to put five on it and let it ride for the full 20x, that I don't mind. I do that myself. But if you're putting 10 or more on these pick'em contests, you better not get greedy and you better ensure it. It's two and a half X, you get four or five, okay? Use promo code CRUSH. Get yourself a full deposit match, but on top of that, get the best deal in the business. 30 days free of the captain's discord. Nobody does it like the captain does. Ask the soldiers that are already in there. It's the best discord community as far as betting and research and all that. Hands down, I'll take that up against anyone. Anyone says different, come on the live mic on TikTok Live and debate me and we'll talk about it. Guaranteed you lose. And that's what's up, folks. That's the end of the video. I'm rushing through here. Like I said, I'm flying through here like a Learjet, boys. A Boeing 747. The captain's pilot in this thing. Let's go. I appreciate each and every one of you guys for watching my YouTube. I know they're long. I know it's boring sometimes, but I'm trying my best to make you entertain. If at least I gave you a smile, would you give the captain a like? Could I ask you for that? And maybe, just maybe, you subscribe to the channel so more soldiers can join the team and we get this algorithm to do its job because oh my goodness the algorithm hates captain crush but at the end of the day when the day is done those of you that are here you're the real one i'm giving you a big salute good luck tonight and as always let's crush